So let me share a project that I'm working on with a colleague. This is an 18 by 24 poster for a classroom of students that features Curious George. Now, as we're looking at this in this view, which is kind of zoomed out, it looks okay. But upon, upon further review, you can see when I zoom in, this picture of George is very much kind of pixelated. It's a lower quality photo. So when I go to print this out, it's not going to look great. This image is going to look a little distorted. So there's a few things that you can do to improve the quality of your images. Now, the first thing that I thought of in this case is if I select the image and maybe remove the background by using the background remover, Maybe I can remove that blue background and I can make this larger. And now if it's larger, maybe the quality will improve. I'm going to zoom in and you can see while the image is larger, it's still not great quality. It still looks distorted. And when I put this up or when I print this, it's going to be a lower quality than I want. So this is how you can improve the visual quality of any image that you upload in Canva. It's by using an app called Upscaler. So to do that, I'm just going to go over to where it says apps and I'm going to search for Upscale. And look, the first option that pops up is this one image upscaler so that's the app that we're going to want to use which is image upscaler here it is i'm going to select open and now i should be good so once you have this app installed in your account you can select any object on the screen in this case i really only have one object and I can choose to upscale this. So you can see there's two times, three times, four times, up to eight times. I guess I'll go somewhere in the middle. I'm going to say four times. Let me select upscale image. And you'll notice right over here in the side, in just a few moments, this image should be done. And hopefully it's a higher quality. All right. So take a look at this. You can see what the image looks like before, a little blurry. And now what the image looks like after. So in this preview window, I think it looks pretty good. Let me go ahead and replace. Okay, there we go. Now there's a little bit of blurriness kind of around the edge, around the outline of this image. Now, if I go back, you'll notice that it's not going to let me upscale. It's not going to let me go any bigger. I can go smaller if I want. So instead, what I'm going to do is just to take that image and add it again to my poster. Okay, here is that image. You can even just see them side by side. One definitely looks a lot more crisp. So for this one, we have four times. This is going to be eight times. Let me try to upscale this at the highest setting and we're going to see the difference between these two attempts. So one of the things like, like you just saw, you can go down, you can't always go up. So it may even be a better place to start at a higher level at eight times, and then maybe go back and reduce it if you need to. So let me replace this. And now what we'll do is look and see these two items side by side. All right, here is four times. And here is eight times. I think that they're both kind of similar. You'll notice that while it does improve the image quality, it can't do everything. So we can't really quite read this the text on this book so well that says Curious George, but that's okay because I think by looking at this, you kind of get the gist. So either way, I took a low res image and I improved the quality of that image with this very simple and free app called Image Upscaler. So if you find yourself in a position like this, you may want to work you may want to use this app to improve the way your image looks. So thanks for watching this video. If you have questions, leave them in the comment area below.